A many-to-many -many relationship is a relationship where many records from one table can relate to many records from another table through the use of an intermediate table known as a junction table. For example, if we had a database that stored information about both our employees and current projects in development, and we wanted to know which employees were working on which projects, and let's say we had two tables, a table that stored employee information and another table that stored project information. Well, there are a few ways that we could relate these tables. First off, we could add an employee number field to our book project table and relate those two tables through the employee number field. But there's a problem with that. If we look at the data table for TBL book projects, you'd see that the project number is not allowed to repeat because that's our table's unique identifier. Therefore, if we wanted to assign a second employee to any given project, well, we wouldn't be able to because we couldn't repeat the project number 1001 in this table. We could, however, remove the primary key altogether and that would be one way to work around the problem. Access would then let us add a second record referring to project number 1001. But if we do that, we'd have to enter all that project information again. And as we know, repeating data equals poor database design for it takes up additional space, meaning that querying information takes longer, not to mention the potential for error with having to retype information over and over again. So this solution isn't really a great solution. And if we were to relate the tables the other way, joining the project number from TBL book projects to the employees table, we'll encounter the same problem as before. The employee number couldn't be repeated. So the solution is the many-to-many -many relationship, which looks just like this. Three tables where one table in this case, our project junction table, will act as a bridge between the two tables that we want to relate, in this case, TBL employees and TBL book projects. And you can always spot the junction table by its composite key or two primary keys. So looking at the data table, here's what the information would look like. Here, we can see that the employee number 12345678 that employee is working on two different projects, project number 1001 and project 1002. And the employee with the number 9875631366 is also working on projects 1001 and 1002. So in essence, not one field, but the combination of these two fields acts as the table's unique identifier thus making a many-to-many -many relationship possible. And that is what a many-to-many -many relationship is. Thanks for watching. For more information regarding our training videos, please visit www.trainsignal.com.